Hello everybody and welcome to today's video. This video will focus on descriptive statistics in Stata. I'm going to show you how to use the summarize command and how to use the tabulate command. So for this video we will be working again with the automobile data that is provided by Stata. So let's load that data set. We just type sysuse auto and we hit enter. Data set has been loaded. So let's say that we want to have descriptive statistics about the price of the cars. So <clears throat> the way we get the first overview about this variable is we type summarize and then we type the name of the variable which in this case is price. Summarize price and we hit enter. What we get now is this little overview that shows us the number of observations, 74. So we know that we have 74 different unique observations for which the variable price is available. Then we see the mean, so the average, or the first moment as it's called in statistics, and the first moment, uh, the mean of price here is 6000 something. Here we have the standard deviation, which is the second moment, and we also see the minimum value and the maximum value. So we know that in this data set the cheapest car costs $3,291 and the most expensive car costs $15,906. What if we want to know more than just these 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 numbers? So if we want to know more about the variable price, we again type summarize price but then we type comma D in the end. And what the D in the end means is we get more detailed summary statistics. So we hit enter again and now we see that we see the percentiles which we didn't have before on this column. So we know that the median is 5006.5. This, this tells us that half of observations have a price below 5006.5 and half has a price above 5006.5. We also see the smallest and the largest value in within the percentiles and here we again have the summary statistics some of which we already saw in the command before for instance the mean here is again 6165 and if we scroll back up this is exactly the mean that we saw before. Same goes for the standard deviation. We also see here this Hunus and the Kurtosis, which are again the higher moments, which before we did not see. So <clears throat> another nice thing is the histogram command. So let if we just type histogram price, we get an actual histogram of this price variable. So here we see that most observations are just below 5000, as we know from the uh, detailed summary statistics, the 50% percentile, so the median of this distribution is 5006, so that's why it makes sense that ha like about half of the observations are just below 5000. And we also see that we have a pretty long distribution on the right of the median, which is of course because we have a few very expensive cars in the data set. The last thing I wanted to show you is the tab command. We can go on tab price, hit enter, and then we get a frequency table. So what this shows us, there's more and more and more, okay, this is the entire frequency table. What we see here is all the 74 prices, 74 different prices that we have in our data set. Here it always says frequency 1, so that means that there is no price that occurs in the data set twice. Here it shows us the percentage and here it shows us cumulative. This is just the added percentages so in the, in the end it will be 100 always. Okay this is nice if you just want to check uh, the frequency distribution of uh, a variable. Maybe it gets clearer if I show you a different variable. Let's say we say tab foreign hit enter and here we only have uh, we see there are only two different uh, entries so the the variable foreign always takes on a value of domestic or foreign and 
here we know now that 52 times out of 74 the car is listed as domestic. In percent it means 70.27% of the sample. And the rest of the cars, as we see here, is foreign. One last thing. If we type tab and we take the repair 78 variable and we hit enter, you will notice here that the total is only 69. But we know we have 74 observations. What does this mean? It means that for 5 observations this variable is missing. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have a great day and good luck with your Stata endeavors. Take care.